Hello, Virgo, and welcome to your weekly reading. No, it's not a coffee cup reading. They will resume next week. Now, um, the reason I'm doing gemstone for you this week, and I will pull a card. I shuffle them at the end, too, with this. Um, cause I did start the rest of the reading is that my voice has not been the best and coffee was irritating it. So I'm trying to heal and I'm allergic to a lot of dust and somehow I got caught up with inhaling dust. Long story. Um, and I know my voice is sounding much better with, um, Virgo, but everybody else got pretty much, um, gemstone. So, which is nothing's wrong with gemstones. I know there are people out there who love the coffee cups. Some love the gemstones, but they will resume next week. But anyway, this is a reading for the week of March 22nd through the 28th, and it is a very general reading. I already did cast the stones, and I will pull a card at the end too. So what are we, let's take a look here what we're seeing. Virgo, things will fall into place, but it's like not everything, you know, this is an imperfect world. Um, nothing, it's not that everything has to be in perfect order because we're seeing too much of a perfect order, okay? For others, there are steps that need to be taken, okay? Um, what I'm seeing here, um, I mean, very sunny energy. There is some confusion and needing some clarity. You do have your wish and good luck and fortune stone here. It's a little in the reverse. You do have a personal tower, so things are changing in your personal world. Partnership money is showing up. Money, and this could be worries about money, but also being, like, hurt by someone or carrying on some resentment. Um, Compassionate energy is here, but it's in the reverse, too. Your passions, goals, desires, listening and learning is going to be important. You need to follow the rules this week, which this means um, with authority, um, law, whatever it is, follow the rules. Because it needs to slow down somehow. That could indicate um, as easy as uh, stopping on a stop sign, um, not challenging authority. You know, you can't break the rules. Let's put it that way. You have to follow the rules. That's what I'm fe feeling for some of you. Money should be coming in. Home and foundation is um, showing up here too. Some adjustments with what you love. Money, all of that spiritually and emotionally connecting is very, very important in creating a new cycle here. So you have very interesting... Very interesting um, stones. Popularity. You're kind of in the spotlight whether you want to or not for good or for bad. Okay, like I said, follow the rules is very important. Now, there is an underlining energy of um, you're attracting good things, good or bad. But the thing is, this is like a good for business. This is good if you're doing um, home interior design, modeling, um, something like that, or cosmetics. There is a good business deal coming through here, too. So I do see that kind of energy. Creative solutions are showing up. You may have some decisions to make, okay? I do see that kind of energy showing up as well overall. Um, I do see that this is like you're kind of uh, holding things close to the chest. You're not speaking or expressing things, and then people are assuming things. So miscommunication is showing up. Trust issues is a problem, and I do feel you may, it's like you're almost not knowing which way to go with something. So um, decisions are coming up here, too, as well. I do see that. Maybe some doors have closed. New doors are opening. There's a new path, new journey, new path, new attraction. And that's kind of your challenge going with the new. Um, I do feel that there is a Leo energy or someone who exhibits those energies showing up as well. Now, I do feel you overall here is like you're holding on to energy a little bit too tightly. Um, so you need to let go of that. And for some of you, you know, you could be holding on to some anger, uh, jealousy. There's some kind of resentment that is carrying on here. You need to release. This is also money's on the mind. Um, you're kind of like not giving all of yourself or, you know, you're kind of shutting down your emotion or uh, finances. Okay. So I'm seeing that kind of energy as well. You're keeping things more to your chest, but kind of let go of the energy. Making sound financial decisions is very important for the future as well, okay? Very important. When I'm looking here, too, I'm seeing love. There is some decisions you're going to have to make because there is something that's in focus. You don't exactly have the love stone except this here, which indicates to me things did not turn out the way you thought they'll be with the love relationship, maybe a current one. 
there are some decisions or it's just going back in time. There is something that it didn't turn out the way you thought it would be. Okay. With relationships, loves, whatever, whatever it is, there's some decisions and choices. Um, it's not what you thought it'll be. Thing, it's like you've been waiting for something and comes in, in a different form or way. I don't know. There's something there. When it comes to also your finances and work and that I do see there are a lot of changes are occurring here. Um, there is people, situations may be leaving your life. You may not be on the same page. There could be some conflicts. Um, I would not challenge, um, like I'd play with by the rules because again, there is this energy of you can cut your nose off despite your face is not good. Okay. There's no win-win situation here for some of you. They, they could be, it's like, um, leaving, um, some kind of conflict, maybe a little bit with work. There are some changes, change of perspective, or you may hear that they may be uh, cutting some people out or, um, you know, there is that energy, I have to say for some of you, so that that is showing up. But you're very driven to succeed. I do see that. I see money coming in, uh, partnerships. And where do you owe money? Shared resources. All of that is coming through. Um, It's like... <clears throat> That money is coming through, but it's like if you got to take care of your taxes or anything like that, too. But that there is something showing up here, but there should be money coming through. A lot of money showing up. Now, I do see there's an ending when it comes to finances. There, It's like you're, you reach your limit, your credit card limit, or um, maybe there is um, a lot of responsibilities or burden. But you're on the right path, okay? So there's a little bit of worries with money, but I do see the money coming through. Uh, definitely what you need to know, there is spiritual intervention here too. There is wishes that you want, uh, making your prayers and affirmations. They do come with delays, any kind of delays there in your favor. You have to um, <clears throat> go with the flow more and connect spiritually too. I feel a Virgo energy is uh, showing up here too, but this is a sense of um, be open. Open your heart to new belief systems. Um, not every, you know... Um, it's like being open-minded is showing up here as well. Patience, um, is showing up here is very important. Um, this is like a lot of messages may be coming through. Maybe there's thoughts of travel, somewhere you're wanting to travel and that, um, I do see money. This is money addition to will be coming through though. Yeah, that's looking good because the new cycle is showing up. Messages are very important. Um, there's like a lot of messages coming through, paying attention to spiritual messages, but also, you know, a lot of emails, a lot of, um, yeah, a lot of emails, messages, but social media. But this could be even thoughts of traveling, okay? Um, wanting to travel, all right? So we're seeing that kind of energy coming through. Um, overall, you got really a lot of changes here. Um, new path, new beginnings here and trying to um, shut down some kind of hurt feelings or worries as well, okay? Something with love is not the way you thought it would be. It's like some decisions are really coming up that need to be made too, okay? All right, so let's pull a card. You have the Ace of Cups. Wow, that's nice. So what do we just say? New paths, okay? Renewal of love, new love coming through, New spiritual journey. It's the beginning. It's feeling good. Feeling yourself up with, I mean, this cup is overflowing, right? What I'm feeling here is you. there's a new start. There's a new refreshment here. Watch the emotions because when we do have sometimes this, this could be just overflowing with emotions. Things are going to start moving quick. There could be a fast pace of something coming through. This indicates you're leaving some um, worries behind, maybe even some fears um, I do feel stay positive the next three days. You need to think positive because a lot of things that you want. I mean, it's like this is a beginning. There's everything you want and desire. It's right there for you. OK, it's within reach. Things are come in due course of time. OK, for some of you, I indicate you will have a total victory in whatever area in your life. I don't know. It's a very general reading, but I feel some kind of victory is coming through too, and a new path. OK. Be open to a new love or a new way, <clears throat> a new uh, beginning in love. All right. Well, Virgo, that was your reading for the week of March 22nd through the 28th. I will resume the coffee cups next week. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week for your coffee cup reading. Bye for now.